overall a really good game of cricket, I would say, but I um, thought we bowled and fielded really well as a unit. Um, guys executed really well, managed to take wickets throughout, which was obviously always key in T20 cricket, but um, unfortunately with the bat probably went up to standards and that, that left us a bit short, but uh, a great game for cricket ultimately and, and great entertainment for the viewers. Yeah, I think 30 for four, um, no matter what you're chasing, you become under pressure. So um, from our point of view, probably look to keep our intent up. I think we probably fell into the trap of thinking we can just bat normally here and um, hopefully get, then get over the line. But um, we still want to be positive, still have a play with proper intent. And um, then from there, we can sort of live, live with our mistakes. So just let ourselves down on slightly with the bat. Um, guys in the middle order really tried. Stubber, Patrick Kruger, Liam Dawson. Um, but I think we, as a top order, left them a bit too much to do. Absolutely. Um, Stubbs is hitting them really well. Uh, in great form, Patrick Kruger is a really clean striker of the ball. And, and the guys have been putting in hard yards in the net. So um, never lost belief. Even right there, we, we proved that we can almost get, the, get over the line. So. Um, great character from the batting unit, or, or the guys in the middle to lower order, but um, yeah, I think the, unfortunately the top order just needs to contribute a bit more. I wouldn't say so, no. We've been playing some good cricket. Um, bowled and fielded really well for 20 overs, and then ultimately with the bat just uh, went at our best. So it's, it's 20 overs of um, us that needing to go reflect as a batting unit and putting in another good performance. I thought we've, we've batted really well as a unit uh, so far in the comp. So. No need for us to panic. Uh, there's still lots of belief in the camp. Um, and yeah, we, we go again on Saturday, so it's a quick turnaround, but um, by, by no means there's, there's any panic in the camp. Yeah, we are. We, it happens quite often nowadays in cricket, but um, physically, obviously, the, the body takes its toll eventually. So it's about sort of getting those recovery things right, um, being a bit meticulous with that when, when you play back-to-back -back games. Um, but. Yeah, the boys are pretty used to it from a mental point of view. We'll be up, we'll be sharp as, as we always are and um, hopefully that can be enough for us on Saturday. It was slightly challenging. Um, honest opinion, I don't think it was 130 plays, 130. Um, thought it's probably not a 200 wicket like we used to at Centurion, but um, certainly a bit more than 130. So uh, for us as a batting unit, that'll be the reflections. Um, we'll look for the reasons why we, we weren't able to build partnerships and, and certain batters for us to get in. Um, and then hopefully rectify those mistakes on Saturday. It's very strange, to be honest. Um, rocking up here, walking into the away change room, it's, it's, a, it's a weird one for me, but always love playing cricket here. The fans have always been um, really good. They support well, they, they understand the game really well, and they pick up on those sort of momentum shifts. But I um, suppose you have to get used to it now. Um, got another home in St George's Park and love playing cricket there as well. So. Uh, you get used to that, but, but either way, rocking back to, to Pretoria is always fantastic for me. Sure. Um, close one. But, uh, yeah, I think, we, I think we're still looking for the perfect game. Um, I think on the batting side, we, we're still trying to strive for a lot more. Um, but, yeah, with that being said, I think that was a pretty clinical bowling performance from the guys today. Um, so, yeah, it shows that we still have some fire in our belly. Um, so hopefully we can take that going forward into the next game. Um, I think it's pretty much only been the last two games where it's been like that. Um, I think if you take away those two runouts, it's obviously a little bit different. Um, again, and then you obviously you have a little bit more power going back into the last couple overs. So I don't think it's anything that's really bothering us at the moment. But obviously it's still something I feel like we'll, we'll talk about. And yeah, I think we're just trying to get better uh, game by game. And hopefully we can do that. Um, I think if you look at the first two games, uh, maybe take away the first game, um, we were pretty close. And I think Paul played a, or bowled really well um, in their own conditions. Um, so yeah, I think we just, we're just looking, like I said earlier, just looking to, to get better and better every game. Um, but yeah, like I said, I think we're looking, looking to play our perfect game. And, but yeah, we're still striving for that. Um, I think... I think the guys just knew that we, we had to put up a fight. Um, yeah, obviously, with us being at the bottom of the log, we, we knew that we, we had nothing to lose. Um, just go out there and enjoy each other's company. Um, yeah, I think that's pretty much what we, what we did. And obviously, we had a really nice start. And, and in the middle, Rash and Pani 
um, took some crucial wickets for us. Um, so yeah, that's obviously obviously clinical in, in a game like this where you're defending a low total. Um, it's not often that we we'll actually end up going all the distance. Um, so yeah, I think we really, really put in a good effort and I think that shows the character that's with, within the group. Um, and yeah, hopefully we can take it going forward. Yeah, uh, playing at Centurion is always, is always a privilege. Um, the crowd's always electric. And so for them to get behind us, and I think it was, they were behind us the whole 20 overs, not just the first six. Um, so yeah, they're pretty special. Uh, I, I think it, it shows that there's a lot of belief within the, in the group. Um, Supersport Park is known for a lot of runs and that kind of thing. So to defend 120 odd or whatever it was, um, really shows that we, that we are up for this and, and we want to try to fight for a playoff spot.